After this woman went into labor, her birth was a once in 480 years event. Labor wasn't a new experience for Alexandra Canova, who had already welcomed a son with her partner, Antonin Kroskin. But they likely looked forward to it anyway, because the second time Canova gave birth was the first of a kind for nearly 500 years. Although Canova and Kroskin were already parents once over, they had always dreamed that their second pregnancy might be something even more special. Twins. Multiples ran in both of their families, and they hoped that they too would be so lucky as to have two babies at once. It's true that a family history of multiples can lead to twins down the line, although it only applies to the mother's gene pool. She is the one who will produce multiple eggs at once, which can lead to a multiple pregnancy. Of course, this only increases the odds of fraternal twins. They come from separate eggs. On the other hand, identical twins are born when a single fertilized egg splits to create two embryos. There's no genetic predisposition for having identical twins as far as scientists are concerned. Still, Canova and Kroskin had genes in their favor, at least when it comes to fraternal twins. So when the couple found out that they were pregnant for a second time in 2013, they excitedly waited for their first ultrasound. This most likely took place eight weeks into the pregnancy. That's when most doctors peer into the womb for the first time. Any sooner and the fetus would be too small to see. After two months, though, Canova's doctor could see exactly who she and Kroskin were expecting. The doctor counted not one baby, but two. The couple's dream of having twins was going to be realized. The family from the Czech Republic, since 2016, also known as Czechia, went home to Milovais, a town northeast of Prague, and started to prepare for their new additions. Part of that preparation included another ultrasound, sometimes recommended in the second trimester for moms who are expecting multiples. During that March 2013 appointment, though, Canova's doctors discovered something unexpected in her womb. This time, though, they no longer saw twins. Doctors told the mom-to-be that she was actually having quadruplets. The fact that Canova was expecting four babies was staggering, especially since she hadn't received any fertility treatments. The chances of naturally conceiving quadruplets is approximately 1 in 700,000, according to Joseph Davis, a gynecologist and fertility specialist. Davis spoke on the subject when a Wisconsin couple had the same experience, which he described as exceedingly rare. But what happened at her next ultrasound appointment made her situation one of a kind. Once again, doctors used the device to look inside her womb and make sure the babies were developing properly. They diligently counted the number of little ones, but their count didn't end at four. Instead, they realized that Canova was expecting five babies. Unsurprisingly, she told Denik.cz that she was in shock when she found this out, just one month before the babies were due. When we finally found the fifth head, I started to cry, she recalled. Although doctors could finally definitively count the number of babies she and Kroskin were having, they couldn't say how many were boys and how many were girls. Their view into the womb was partially obscured. Still, there was no denying the incredibility of Canova's pregnancy. Naturally, conceiving quintuplets is even more of a rarity than it is for quadruplets. Experts place the odds at 1 in 55 million. Rather than focusing on the once-in-a-lifetime pregnancy she endured, Canova could only look toward the future. I very much look forward to seeing how they will look, she said. It's a great charm, but we cannot see anything properly, only a head or legs. The only thing left to do was to deliver the babies and make history in the process. It turned out that no woman had ever given birth to quintuplets in the recorded history of the Czech Republic, which has been kept since 1949. Alina Michirova, one of Canova's doctors, said that it had likely been almost half a millennium since something like this had happened in the country's history, even without a written record of it. In the Czech Republic, quintuplets are born on average once every 480 years, she said. To ensure everything went smoothly, 40 medical professionals gathered to help with Canova's delivery. Doctors, specialists, and midwives worked together to bring the five babies into the world via cesarean section, four boys and one girl. Sons, Danielle, Michael, Alex, and Martin, and daughter, Tereska, came into the world and immediately went to Prague's Institute for the Care of Mother and Child's Intensive Care Unit. But doctors said the babies were born without complications and had a 95% chance of growing up completely healthy. In June 2013, prognosis proved to be accurate. As of July 2017, Canova and Kroskin had healthy quintuplets who more than fulfilled their dream of having multiples, and they made history in their home country in the process.